everybody! Today I'm going to be doing my winter TBR. I did a video similar to this back in fall where I listed some of the books that I really wanted to get to within the fall season. So I'm doing a similar thing because the winter season is upon us in like a few days. The first book that I really want to get to in winter is Dash and Lily's Book of Dares by Rachel Kahn and David Levithan. This book follows a girl named Lily and a guy named Dash as they write down different dares in this red notebook at the Strand Bookstore in New York city. It takes place during Christmas time and I just can't wait to curl up with this book with some hot chocolate in my bedroom and read it. It sounds really adorable and I just can't wait to read it. I've heard such good things about it. The next book I want to get to is My True Love Gave to Me which is 12 holiday stories written by 12 different authors and it's all edited by Stephanie Perkins. I'm going to get through a few of the stories before Christmas because I really like the idea of 12 different holiday stories wrapped up into one book. I, it sounds really adorable, the entire like concept of it. And I know that there's a summer one out too called Summer Days and Summer Nights, which is also edited by Stephanie Perkins. I just can't wait to dive right in. Another very Christmassy book is What Light by Jay Asher. This book follows a girl who lives in Oregon and she grew up on a Christmas tree farm. Every year she goes to California to set up a Christmas tree farm. And normally whenever she's in one place, she always misses the other. Until one year where she meets this guy named Caleb and everything changes. This book sounds very interesting. I really can't wait to read it. The next book that I want to try to get to in winter, I don't know if I will, but it's Eleanor and Park by Rainbow Roll. This book follows a girl and a guy named Eleanor and Park during one school year in 1986 so I'm guessing that there's going to be some winter in this story. I've heard really great things about this book and I really can't wait to pick it up and read it. And this is really the last contemporary story on this list and it's Girl Online by Zoe Sugg. This book follows a girl named Penny who writes on this blog anonymously called Girl Online and one year her parents decide to take her over to New York City for Christmas vacation and there she meets this guy named Noah and she ends up falling in love with him. It sounds adorable, it's a Christmassy read and I really can't wait to pick it up before for Christmas, hopefully. So now we're kind of transitioning into the fantasy slash sci-fi portion of the TBR. One of the books that I really want to get to before the year ends is The Son of Neptune by Rick Riordan. This book is a second book in the Heroes of Olympus series and it continues off, I think, straight from book one. Book one was really good. I really enjoyed it and I really want to continue on with the series. I just have not picked it up yet. I have no excuse for it except that I just haven't picked it up and I'm really hoping to pick it up soon because I really love these characters and I really love this world and I just can't wait to continue reading about this world and all the characters in it. I set this book in my November TBR and I never read it and that is Winter by Marissa Meyer. This book is the last book in the Lunar Chronicles and I really can't wait to see how this story wraps up. I really hope everyone ends up living happily ever after. And these last two books really go together so I'm probably gonna read one then go straight into the other. The first one being Tales from the Shadowhunter Academy by Cassandra Clare, Sarah Reese Brennan, Maureen Johnson, and Robin Wasserman. This book is a bind-up of the 10 novellas that take place in between City of Heavenly Fire and Lady Midnight. I really enjoyed City of Heavenly Fire. That ending just like kind of left me hanging. So I figure I'll pick this up pretty soon because I really want to continue with the series and finish all these novellas and then go on to the next book in my TBR, which is Lady of Midnight by Cassandra Clare. This book is the first book in her new series. The Dark Artifices. I've heard nothing but wonderful things about it and I really can't wait to read it. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my YouTube channel. I post videos every Thursday and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!